And Diana, we're rolling. Another one. You're in a bad mood. I'm in a bad mood? Yeah. I'm not in a bad mood. Why are you in a bad mood? I'm gonna make it so cozy here. Or cozy. Like, so good for the QA. Look at this, eh? We're ready. You're doing your on camera face, though. First, when do I do this? When, when, do I... when you know that the camera's on you. Okay. So, this is fast as normal face, and it's normal, and he <laughs> smells a lot, and he lets his eyes go small, and then you know the camera's on, and you're like, that's. <laughs> okay, shall we do this Q&A? Didn't you want to wear a different t-shirt? Wow, judging. That gives me the time to sort of say where we are at with the vlog. Oh uh, no, Q&A's. I think this is my Q&A number five. I think this is our Q&A number two. Okay, I'm gonna practice my on-camera boss face. It's, it's, look at me, I am such a charming Dutch man. Show me? Yeah, no. Yay! <laughs> that was it! Okay, how are we gonna do this? Well, you're gonna answer some questions. Yeah, because um, we asked you to come up with some questions and to have them underneath this post. How... There. Are you hungry? You really not hungry? No. You really not hungry? No. I really have to get food, boss. Okay, yeah, we can do that, you can order. I'm gonna write in caps. No cheese. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. Intimacy at Wait, wait. Nay, no, no. Is it me? Intimacy at Wait, wait. Because I thought so. I'm getting even stuck already. Look at me. Okay, am I going to your page? How did you find yourself so quickly? Because I was on the top of your search list. Honestly, oh, that was it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> first question, where can I find the, find the first Q&A? On my YouTube channel. What's the weirdest place that you've bashed out a workout in? From Daniel Hobbs, 32. Yeah, like the smallest hotel room ever in Japan. That's cool. Because hotel rooms in Japan are like really, really tiny. 10 square meters and then you pay full rate. And I, I remember that there was a bed and the only thing you can do was narrow push-ups. What, what's your craziest? They saw it on Instagram. Oh yeah, at, at the uh, airport. We worked out all the way through the airport. Oh, airport. Ever, ever. I worked out on the bus, I did chin-ups on the bus, I did burpees in the hallway. Oh yeah, I've seen that too. I did cartwheels down the, um, down the hallway. Is it a hallway? Yeah. Down the hall in the airport. Yeah, yeah. Great. Dear Diana Mills, why bus doesn't eat cheese? Why? Why, why bus doesn't does? bus eat cheese? Let's play a game. Bus. Yeah. I'm going to ask, I'm going to say a concept that most people are pretty cool with and you say whether you like it or not, okay? Okay, okay whether you can handle it or not. Okay, okay. Okay, cheese. No. Okay, um, tomato sauce and mayonnaise together. Yeah, as long as they're not no. touching. Okay. <laughs> as long as they're not touching. Any sort of liquid in a solid food. I'd no. rather not. No, exactly. Diana Mills, which programs do you think I get to your have. little people will be teaching when they grow up? And do you look forward to sharing the stage with them like you do with your amazing mom? That's a nice question. Yeah, I, I think about that a lot because when I choreograph at home and the kids are around, they always join in. They're really big on yoga. Okay. Everyone does yoga. And Luxon does a lot of ballet now. Yeah. Yeah. But he is so cute. Ballet, we, went, so cute. we went trick or treating uh, during Halloween with, um, with her whole family. That was so cool. Happy Halloween, everybody. We had 12 children to look after. Which programs do you think they will be teaching? Uh, Max will teach Body Jam. Max's moves are stellar. Yeah. Gail gets a lot of his content from Max. Okay. Max is contemporary as... <laughs> uh, Luxon is going to teach bar, obviously. He's uh -huh. a And Luna, probably combat. She's incredibly vicious. Yeah. Geo, I want to say Geo will find his inner calm and teach body balance. Better? That's a good, good stretch. Good. Yeah, I'd like We've got that whole the... consumer matrix model <laughs> yeah. covered. Okay, next question. Okay, describe the feeling when you're up the round stage presenting at Amsterdam from Shazwina, the squad team. As both of us go. How was it? It was so cool. Mm -hmm. It was so, it was, I, I, I told some of the people here in the office that I was so happy to show everybody 
um, that I usually work with here in, in, in Auckland that I can show them where I'm from. It was so nice to have you all there. Um, I think the crowd was amazing. I think the venue looks stunning. How was it for you, eh? The crowd was incredible. On the first day, I did body balance. Um, and all of what I said, but also up on the very top of the stage, I stood there for the first time. It was like I got vertigo. Yep. It was so high up and there were so many people. It was like, <laughs> oh my gosh. It was the most nervous I've ever been. And then the best experience, the crowd was. Yeah. Remarkable! Yeah. It was so beautiful. It was my favorite filming ever. Amsterdam was really cool. Yeah, it's, it really was. Can boss longer speak Japanese? No, I'm learning. I, I, I've, I've been learning all these things that you can't really use. I can say the police on his horse. Say it. scam to kare no uma. And I can say the woman is wearing a pants. <laughs> or, or not a pants, but a skirt. I, that's, wow. a, that's a good sentence. Ona no hito wa subono o haiti imasen, kanojo wa o haiti. No, skato o haiti imas. Skato is skirt. Skato! Skato! Okay, next question, because this was. An, I feel um, like the things you can say in Japanese like will really help in a crime scene investigation. Yeah. Three words, fast, to describe the trip 12. Oh, wow. Um, the trip 12. Okay. That one that you just filmed. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Was, uh, Diana was here too. You should do that. It was awesome. It That's was what? buzzing. Buzzing. A bus. Awesome buzzing bus. <laughs> there you go. Well, next question. And and three words to describe tone. Uh, freedom. And also. Uh, but then culture. Help really long. Culture. Freedom. Inclusive. We and all... changing the landscape of the industry and it's going to be cool and everyone can do it and you can just change the class to be whatever the people in front of you need it to be. Stop it. 30, mi 30 minutes, 45 minutes, 55 minutes. Focus on cardio, focus on strength, use a band, use plates. Freedom! Who's your favorite philosopher? Bath. I did a degree in philosophy at Auckland University. Oh yeah? Yeah, probably Plato. Ancient philosophers, super cool. Ah, this is interesting. I would love to see a way to combine combat pump flow into an hour workout. It's called tone. What life skill would you say is the most important to have as an instructor? Ooh, we have some good questions today. Generally liking the people you teach to. Yeah, liking people is yeah. a really good thing. Being sociable. Yeah, and not seeing yourself as better or anything, just... Humble? Humble? Yeah. Yeah, being really cool and accepting of yourself because it allows you to really accept everyone else and go with what they mm. need and not making it about you. Okay, this question is, can you please add your amazing song into the video? And what is this? What? Jenna. Oh, Jenna. Jenna, that's the oh, song. Oh, yeah. yeah, we can. No, we can't. Absolutely. No, we're running out of time. <clears throat> okay, I have to do it when you do it. Five, six. Five, six, seven, eight. Boston Diana. Boston Diana. Forever. Forever. Fighting crime. Having a heck of a time. A really good time. I feel that we could have done better. Thanks, Jenna. Thanks, If you're Jenna. watching this. Any, any chance I get to sing that song. What's your favorite Les Mills workout? Um, I always switch between grit and sprint. Some moments I like sprint better. Sometimes I like grit better. I like grit because it's more diverse. I like sprint because it's so hard. Like the difference between working hard and working at your max is just a turn to the right, like a millimeter adjustment to the right or left. Yeah, that's what I like to do. Only on the bike thing. Only on the bike thing. I love you do uh, sprint. On the, on the turning thing, I do only do the release that Bas does, and I yell at Bas a yeah, lot yeah. and refuse to do the things that he does. Before. I'm remembering sprint. I wanted your job, but is the journey worth it? Oh, we're back at our life question. Yeah, it takes a lot of dedication, energy, and of course money to be there. So I'm still in doubt about going further. This is for you, I think, because I was born into this company. <laughs> and I, I, I had to make my way through it. Yeah. Um, is it worth it? For me, it's 100% worth it. I think the things that I've learned within this company I wouldn't be able to describe it in, in like in money wise. What I'm trying to say is what I've learned is so much more mo uh, worth than money for me. Best friends forever. Best friends forever with Diana. 
for example. But all these small things, like what we spoke about, be, I was quite insecure in the beginning when I was uh, when I became a trainer, not so much a trainee, but then a trainer. And overcoming that thing, like that was that was so that's so still so important for me. So um, is it worth it? Yes. Um, but I can't decide that for anybody else. I think it depends on so many other things. What? He's telling the truth. I can tell. I also think that we have an important role to play in the people we teach, um, in their lives. Yeah. Um, I don't. I, I don't like that dramatic stuff. Like you're changing somebody's life completely. Like that might happen for some. Mm -hmm. Some people that you teach might com uh, change their life completely. But for some people, it's just they don't like working out. But because you're their instructor, they like it a little bit better. Yeah. And they, and they keep showing up every single week, once a week. And that's a, that's a change as well. And I think yeah. all these small things are, are, yeah, they make it work. You get to be a highlight of someone's day. That's really cool. Yeah. And if it's your passion, I mean, how much is too much if you're actually pursuing what you yeah. love to do? What sounds better? This is Rosa's question. Maybe we should finish with this one. Rosa. Yes. Rosa is the girl we film uh, Board to Move 8 to 12 with. Um, what sounds better? Boss vlogs or Rosa's vlogs? <laughs> I like Rosa's vlogs. It rolls off better. the tongue. Yes, Bus vlogs. vlogs. It's Bus difficult. Vlogs. And she always took over the vlog when vlogs. we are. Sounds Rosa's better. Rosa's vlogs is pretty. It's like a brand of jam or something. Did that not make sense? Do you have anything to add to this Q&A? Um, I already sang the song. We sang the song. We shouldn't get into that again. Okay, thank you for watching. See you next time. Maybe in Tokyo. Otherwise in, in March. Gosh. That's Q&A number six. But our Q&A number three. I was being a mime. So high-fiving me. I just broke the glass. <laughs>